Hi everyone, let's make harlequin stitch with Tunisian touch. I will be using this mercerized crochet cotton in peach and off-white color. And the crochet hook is 5. This is meant for a fingering cotton. And scissors. Let's begin by using the off-white cotton. Let's create 24 chains plus 1. 24 chains because it should be in multiples of 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, plus one. At the very first space, yarn over, and then insert hook, then yarn over. We will be making four path stitches on this into this very first space yarn over pull through then another second half stitch pull through third fourth create chain one and then let's count four spaces Except this one. Two, four. Let's make a single crochet there. Sorry. And then for, for at the fourth, two, two, the fourth space again. Create seven puff stitches. Okay. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, seven puff stitches, and then count four spaces again. Two, four, create the single crochet, and then create. Let's repeat it. I think I wasn't able to get the entire. Cotton two four there. Create again another seven puff stitches at the fourth space. Two four. It's a little bit of struggle because this is a very tiny cotton and plus a very tiny crochet hook first puff stitch second third fourth fifth sixth seven and space uh, chain one then we will be at the last chain let's create just like the at the beginning we will create four puff stitches
for you then. I'll get the my stitch marker. Okay. We can for the next round or row we can start from here or the other end. Doesn't matter. For the next row we will be using this peach the peach cotton. Sorry. We will start from this space. Let's secure the peach cotton first. Then let's collect loops. Third, fourth, fifth, six. We only need six loops. We are Creating now the Tunisian stitches or Tunisian touch for this project. Okay, pull through two, 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 pull through two and then insert hook, turn over, insert over we need to complete the six loops every time turn over insert turn over we have now five and then for the six in this space so we have now six loops this is for the second row for the Tunisian Two. always pull through two okay we're done with the second row then same insert pull through insert pull through insert yarn over I mean insert yarn over pull through two pull through two pull through two pull through two Pull through two. We are done with. We are done with the third row. Let's get to the fourth. Then here, six loops again. Pull through two. 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 We have now four rows. This is the Tunisian Tunisian stitch. Let's close this one. We're doing this. Okay. Insert. Turn over. Pull through two. Insert. Turn over. Pull through two. Insert. Turn over. Pull through two. And then slip stitch. There. That's how it looks like. Then let's create the next Tunisian. Two, three, two. Four loops now. We need six, right? Okay, there. Pull through two, pull through two, pull through two, pull through two, pull through two. That is the first row. Next. Insert, yarn over. Insert, yarn over. Insert, yarn over. Insert, yarn over. Six loops, pull through two. Pull through two, 
pull through two, pull through two, pull through two. We're done with the second row. Let's get to the third. Pull through two, pull through two, pull through two, pull through two, pull through two. Third row, remember it's always six loops. We have to create. And there. Pull through two, pull through two. Pull through two, pull through two, pull through two. This is the fourth row. Let's close it. You slip stitch. Is it? Is it pretty? Let's go to the last Tunisian stitch. Stitch. Okay, three. Now we have six loops. Go through two. First row is done. Let's get to the next. Let's get to the third row. Fourth row. Fourth row is done. Let's close it. Make a chain one. There. Looks pretty. Very nice color. I remove this. Let's cut this. Okay. 
let's proceed to the third third round now we will be using again the off white cotton I cut, I cut this off let's start the start. third row by using the off white thread I will do is I will secure this first chain one there then we will collect loops puff stitches we will not pull through but we'll do it every space four times then there two three four we have two four six nine loops then pull through chain one and then chain seven three three four five six seven we will we will um single crochet first okay then this is our first third fourth fifth sixth seven every space eight one last time nine nine times nine spaces of puff stitches and then let's pull through slowly you have to position the hook like that and then secure it and chain seven one two three four five five six seven we'll just repeat everything and let's secure it let's single crochet first and then another seven we will be creating seven puff stitches the first puff stitches is only at the beginning and at the end seven four five six seven then secure it at the last stitch that you have made the puff stitch by single crochet and then create the four puff stitches again just like the four puff stitches at the beginning one Three, 
Well, I have an excess here, so let's just continue. Okay. Then pull through. Stitches on top for the four stitches. Let's create four as well. Two, three, two, three, four, and chain one. Let's insert here and create a single crochet and then create seven puff stitches on the very top of this. Insert here. Seven puff stitches again. Doesn't look well. Okay. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, then chain one, and create four puff stitches in here. I don't know, single crochet here first, then four puff stitches here on top, on top of the four puff stitches. finished harlequin stitch with Tunisian touch okay I'll show you the it's kind of long I'll show you my finished product Here I used a 3.0 mm hook. I'll show you. Here. This is much better. This looks better. As long as you don't miss miss any space or stitch, you will come up with a beautiful harlequin stitch with Tunisian touch. Thanks for watching!